Hello, my name is Julia Butterfly Hill. I am most known for having lived in an over 1,000-year-old ancient redwood tree in Northern California in the United States for over two years without touching the ground. To permanently protect the tree, but to also call for permanent protection of our world's old growth forests. I understand from first-hand experience how incredibly difficult and challenging the stand that Miranda Gibson is taking, living in a tree now for a year, to call for the permanent protection of Tasmania's old growth forests. When we see someone like Miranda taking such great risks, risking her very life for a cause, we know that all systems are failing. Governments are failing in their responsibility to protect the public trust. Corporations are failing in their responsibility to provide goods and services that not only make our world a better place, but protect our planet for today and future generations. And consumers are failing in paying attention to what they buy and learning what and who is impacted by their consumer choices. It is an honor to stand in solidarity with Miranda and to call on all of you to stand in solidarity with Miranda, calling for the permanent protection of Tasmania's old growth forests, but also calling for protection of our world's old growth forest. Not only do they help provide a stable climate, they are some of the most important biodiversity banks on our planet, and they also are crucial in protecting the water that we need to survive. Thank you, Miranda, and I honor you on this one year anniversary of you living atop a beautiful tree, doing everything you can, risking your own life to call attention to the importance of these trees and these forests in our lives. Please, everyone who's watching, do everything that you can to support and to stand in solidarity. Together, we can change our world from being one that sees forests only as lumber and board feed, and instead sees our forests as an integral relationship that we co-relate with, protecting our planet for today and for all the children to come.